Hello everyone, this is me Satya here and I'm back with the bonus love reads. This is uh, uh, another series that I started which is going to be talking about the current feelings, energies of the person that you're dealing with. So this reading is going to be for the air signs which is uh, Gemini, Libra and Aquarius. I will be putting the timestamps in the comment section. You can check for your sign uh, by clicking on them. So yeah, I will start with Gemini, then Libra, and then I will get to the Aquarius. But yeah, before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general reading, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the messages which are resonating and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also follow me on Instagram where I do upload daily readings. So yeah, let's see. Um, air signs. I'm going to start with the sign of Gemini. So let's see, Gemini. Um, what is it? that your person is feeling for you, for the connection that they have with you. So whoever it is that you're dealing with, let's see what are they currently feeling for you. What are currently the thinking about you, Geminis, whoever it is that you're dealing with. Ace of Swords. Um, I feel like, you know, with the help of Divine, um, they are having a lot of clarity about you. Maybe there has been a fight argument that you might have picked up. Maybe there was some sort of uh, issue that was going on between the two of you. And maybe you could not prove your point to them. They are now having the clarity around it. Whatever it was, be that in your favor, against you, whatever it was. They are certainly having the clarity around you and um, in that particular situation. Let's take more cards. They are thinking heavily about you. They are thinking heavily about you. And I feel like, you know, this person really... Um, Especially at night time, they, they think about you a lot. Um, somehow, I feel like you know, this person is having some sort of awakening around the connection that they have with you. Um, there are certain things that they were not um, seeing through clearly about the connection that they have with you. Plus, uh, around if there is a situation that you recently dealt with with your person, I feel like you know, they, they now can see it. They now can understand it. They now can understand your perspectives around it as well. So I feel like, you know, this person is heavily thinking about you. I feel like um, um, they do miss you as well. You know, it's, it's more like when they think of you, they miss you and they wish at times that um, I could have handled the situation a better way. I don't know why I'm picking up that energy, but that seems like it. It seems like, you know, there are certain things they wish that they could, uh, you know, could do right, basically. So let's take more cards. Wow. They are going to coming to apologize you. They might come up with a gift, with uh, something to offer to you, with uh, something uh, which is going to bring you a lot of happiness and stability. I feel like, you know, there are major shifts happening uh, with your connection with your specific someone. It's more like, you know, because they are having the clarity around the connection. Um, you can expect this person to come forward with something major to offer. It can be a gift. It can be, if, if it's a gift, it's going to be a major gift. It's going to be something very expensive. It's going to be something very meaningful to you as well. If it's not expensive even, then it's still going to be something very memorable for you for the rest of your life. So this is coming in, um, for some of you, it can be a proposal as well coming from your person. But yes, I feel like, you know, this person is really understanding the situation the connection better and coming forward with something stable to offer which is going to bring you a lot of happiness under the deck we do have the king of wands um i feel like you know there has been some issues between the two of you but then the good news is that those issues um could have been like you know come because of the lack of clarity clouds of doubts fears anxiety uh, maybe somebody listened to other people around the situation and they acted a certain way which they don't like now so whatever it was the negativity from the connection is definitely going away and they are thinking positive and to come forward towards you with something beautiful to gift you I, I would call it a gift because it seems like a gift to me it can be a ring as well if they are proposing you but i feel like you know they will be coming forward with the romantic gesture is what i'm picking up so yeah let's move on to the next sign which is going to be the sign of libra whoever it is that you're dealing with let's find out what is it that your person thinking about you what is it that your person thinking about you? What is it that your person is thinking about you? Libra. Let's see. What is it that your person is thinking about you? I could see the four of wands. 
um, maybe they are uh, they are thinking to have a happy home life with you now maybe they are planning to get married to you maybe they are daydreaming to be your husband or your wife as well um, they might be like acting as their for me they might be you know trying to manifest that as well but they are thinking positive happy thoughts of the good times that you spent together maybe um, recently or maybe in the past or maybe they are planning to have some you know some holiday or vacation time together um, but yeah let's see what else is happening what is it that they have for you what is it that they th uh, thinking and feeling for you Libras Ooh, there is a lot of addictive energy here it seems like you know a person is non-stop thinking about you uh, whoever it is um, they are so sure about the connection that they have with you it's mutual it's uh, whether you say to each other or you express not to each other whatever you feel deeply from within but you are tied to each other and this is something mutual it's not um it's it's more like you know you both know that i don't know if you knew that in the past or not but yes now you both know that this connection is like magical it's never gonna break it's never gonna end it's gonna be like you know getting intensified with every passing second of the day so i feel like you know this connection um uh, they think about you heavily they are addicted to you as well uh be that you know fights be that the happiness be that the arguments be that the fun times they are definitely like you know they are craving for you all the time is what i'm picking up um, seven of cups the fool they don't want this uh, I feel like you know there is something that that annoys your person a lot and they don't want that now uh, they want uh, clarity in the situation uh, from from uh, from you um, what kind of clarity do they want there is something which bothers them around this connection though even though the connection is so strong, the connection is so beautiful, the connection is so um, so like how you would want your connection to be. But then there is something which bothers your person and they really want this energy to go away from the two of you. Uh, what is it? It seems like, you know, your person really wants that... Um, It's more of that energy, you know, when you know that this is going to happen, then why it's not happening right now? You know, if you're bound to be together, if you are like, you know, all each other's, then why this connection is not moving forward? Why it's not heading in the in the right direction there? Why there are delays? Why things are not speeding up? I feel like, you know, that could be the thing which is bothering your person right now. Uh, and maybe with their addiction that they have or with the, with the connection that they feel for the two of you, it seems like you know they, this this delay does bother them a lot and really want to break free from this delayed energy and have the two of you united forever uh the love and hate between the two of you is something which is uh, inevitable is what i'm picking up here it seems like you know you you love each other madly you hate each other madly you have bedtime together uh, you know, if I talk about the sexual thing, that too is mad crazy between the two of you. It's more like a very passionate connection that you have. And this person really loves it. But yes, this is the only thing which they don't like. Under the deck, we do have the Page of Cups. I feel like, you know, either one of you is not opening up or taking this connection to the next level. Whereas one person is dying to take it to the next level. So that's the issue there is what I'm picking up. But it seems like, you know, your person is... Uh, um, they really want now this connection to be something stable long term uh without any uh any further delay they want this connection to move forward change in the right direction they want this thing to end basically they want um you to embrace them and the love you have for them if that's what they are looking for because i feel like you know either one of you definitely wants this connection to grow into something better now uh they want this connection to have an upgrade basically they are tired of this energy which has been maybe stagnant for some of you so yeah that's what they are feeling let's move on to the last sign which is the sign of aquarius let's see how um your person is feeling for you whoever it is that you're dealing with let's see how did they feel for you what is it that they think about you all the time what is it that they have on their mind about the connection that they have with you what is it on their mind what is it that they feel what is it that they want with you what is going on how do they see you? How do they see connection that they have with you? Aquarius. 
for souls uh whenever they think of you they think of lots of people as well how they will say how what they will say there's a lot of uh, people's influence in this uh, you know whenever this person thinks of you there's a lot of uh, messy situations that they think of you along with that um I feel like you know they they want to take some steps towards you but then people stop them or people's influence stop them but at the same time they are not letting go of that hope that one day maybe they will be able to take that step forward towards you let's see um they might be trying to communicate to you or they might have been trying to reach out to you through your dreams through the messages through the uh, telepathic uh situation they might be kind of you know flashing in your eyes uh, out of nowhere while you are driving you are doing something or the other i feel like you know this person might be trying to reach out to you communicate to you somehow they would not physically do because there is a lot of people's influence there but yes they do think of you a lot but they are hurt they are not happy they are upset they 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 want to make a move towards you but they can't uh maybe as uh, you know it's it's more like you know as if they are um they are tied to a situation where they cannot break free from which which is something which is kind of keeping them uh I don't know it's more of that energy where you know you feel uh, stuck or you know as if you're encaged or something like that it seems like you know this person still has hopes around the connection maybe but yes um they don't feel right they do miss you they do think of think of you but i don't see them reaching out to you it's, it's more like you know when the time is right i hope and wish someday i will be doing that you know it's more of that energy somehow this person is stuck some somehow this person is uh, not uh, in the position to make a move towards you and in the deck we do have eight of cups i feel like you know there is something uh, which has tied this person not to take action towards you or something to do with that um but yes i feel like you know um this person might be getting married to someone else uh sometimes they do miss you sometimes i feel like you know one day we will be together again but still they can't do much about the current situation is what i'm picking up what is it it's it's more of that energy hold on <sighs> maybe they have left you and married somebody else as well or if that's the case they don't uh, maybe initially they were kind of okay with it but then that, now they seems to be they, they seem to be unhappy now even if they want to break free from here then come to you they cannot do so is what i'm picking up so yeah that's pretty much it coming up for you for this read if the reading resonated with you do like subscribe and share if you're willing to get a personal read you can always reach out to me for that on my email id in the description box till i do the next reading for you guys take care bye